Welcome to summer camp at the Blackstone Valley Boys and Girls Club. We're hoping this video helps you get a better understanding of your expectations as you travel throughout the zones and into the different areas like the pool and the lunchroom here during your camp days. If you ever have any questions on expectations, please reach out to a staff. But for now, enjoy the video. In Zone 1, we have a basketball court, a four-square court, and also a grassy area. You're welcome to relax or join in on games like basketball. We always show good sportsmanship, and we always ask a staff if we need to leave the area. For example, our friends in this video are asking to use the bathroom. Please always ask the staff before leaving the area to go into the grassy area Hi, as um, well. Go to the grassy area, Should I play tag? Um, yeah, get a staff and make sure that they're with you. Okay. Great. In zone one, we also have the option to cross over onto the four square court. When playing four square, we always set fair rules and play with good sportsmanship. While in the grassy area, we can participate in games like tag or we can choose to relax. It's important that we always ask a staff before entering the grassy area. And if there's no staff present, please do not go into the grassy area. In Zone 2, each piece of playground equipment has its own set of expectations. It's important that we follow each expectation in order to stay safe. When using the zip line, only one friend is allowed on it at a time. We need to patiently wait our turns and keep our hands to ourselves. Only five friends are allowed on the spider at one time. Only one person is allowed on the monkey bars at one time. There's also the option to play Gaga Ball when you're in Zone 2. When playing Gaga Ball, have the staff explain the rules to you if you're unsure. If you do get out, just step over the side and wait patiently for the next round to begin. When using the swings, always stay on the swing at all time and stay out of the swing zone if you are not using a swing. It's important to stay safe and stay clear of others using the swings. There will be other smaller pieces of equipment on the playground that have not been touched upon in this video. If you're unfamiliar with the expectations, please reach out to your staff. Our main goal is to stay safe and have fun. When we walk to zone three, we stay on the sidewalk and out of the parking lot. We always have safe feet and hands. We give our friends their personal space. It's a monster. It's a monster. In zone three, we have a grassy area and another basketball court. Zone three has a lot of areas to play, but keep in mind to please stay off of the stairs and away from the orange fence near the river. When we stand in line, we have safe hands, safe feet. We're in our own personal bubble and we patiently wait for our staff to tell us what to do next. I come into the lunchroom and I wait in line. I can get in line at the window or I can get in line at the door. I order off the menu that I will also have a copy of at home. And while in line, I wait patiently with my hands and feet safe by my sides and I don't yell and scream. I keep personal space and sometimes my food takes a little bit longer to come out. So I step to the side of the window and I wait. During lunch, you have the option to sit at an indoor or an outdoor table. When doing this, it's important that you always clean up your trash, push in your chairs, and be respectful and kind to those sharing the table with you. To come to the pool, I enter the community center and take a right. Sometimes there's a line, but that's okay. I can patiently wait. There will be a lifeguard sitting at the desk in this doorway. I always have to check in with the lifeguard, give them my name and the color of my group before heading into the changing rooms. I will do the same thing when I exit the pool.
Before entering the pool area, I stop at the changing room and change into my bathing suit and shower. It's very important that while I'm in the changing room, I respect everyone's privacy, personal space, and I'm respectful in line and I wait patiently for my turn. The pool is a really fun place to be, but it's very important that I follow all rules and regulations set in place by the lifeguards and the land staff monitoring the grassy area. If I ever have any questions of what's expected of me, I can ask a lifeguard or a land staff at any time. And our last expectation is that you treat each other with kindness and respect. If you see something that you don't think is respectful or kind, please reach out to a staff member. We're here to help you and we hope you have a great summer.